Good morning students. Today I am going to explain Returning to live in the country poem. It was written by Tao Yonmi. Returning to live in the country was written by Tao Yonmi. He is also known as Tao Kyon. He was a Chinese poet and politician. He was one of the best known poets during the 6th dynasty's period. In this poem, the poet tells about his life in city and country. When he was young, he always loved nature. He liked hills and mountains. Unfortunately, he had been living in city for 30 years. So the poet tells, Mindlessly, I was caught in the dust-filled trap. Waking up, 30 years had gone. Living in the city life is a dust-filled trap according to the poet. He was there for 30 years. After 30 years, he longs to return to live in his countryside. He compared himself with caged bird who wants to the old trees and fresh air. Again, the poet tells us that he wants to see fish in pool which he missed for 30 years. After so many years, he works on his fields. He plows the earth at the edge of South Moor. To retain his simple life, he comes again to his plot and garden. His fields is hardly more than a few fields. His country house compresses eight or nine small rooms. Back of his house, there are elm trees and pillows. The tree's shade covers the house. From the doorstep, he can pluck plums and peaches. There are village far away from the fields. He is unable to view the covered He is unable to view the village because it is covered with mist. The mist is moving like a soft spills of smoke. The crows are spotted on top of the mulberry tree. He is happy that there is no heat and dust around his house now. It is covered with nature. No heat and dust behind my closed doors, the poet said. In city, it was full of noise. But in country house, the rooms are filled with the space and silence. He was living in city as a prisoner for 30 years. He missed his country life. He further tells that he was like a captive in a cage. Now he feels that he is connected with nature. Too long a prisoner, captive in a cage. Now I can get back again to nature. So finally the poet tells, the poem portrays the polluted city life of the poet and calm and clean life in countryside. He compares both life but happy with country life. Here I have given the summary. So please go through the summary. These are the websites. I have taken the pictures. Thank you students. Thank you for listening and thank you for watching.